in the spring of 1536. Ignatius, Peter and Lainas set out to Roma. 527 kilometers of tedious road ahead of them. We waited six months in Vincenza, but our plans to go to Jerusalem nearly ended in a blink of an eye. Then all of us decided to go to Rome in groups to meet the Supreme Pontiff. Lo and behold, Carafa became a cardinal whom our Master Ignatius reprimanded. Master Ignatius knew what was to come. He was truly troubled. On the way we sang psalms when Master Ignatius was lost in thoughts. Sometimes he used to draw himself away from us to pray privately. He seemed quite disturbed all along. What do you want me to do, Lord? Then a bolt from the blue shattered Master Ignatius. What's the matter, Peter? Ah, oh, Father Ignatius. Tell me. Linus is seriously ill. Ah. Ah. Linus ah. is ill? Yeah. Oh my god. You must run to him. Master Ignatius ran for his own life. Linus! Linus! Linus, what happened? Linus. After all, Linus. he loved us like his own children. He put us before himself. Take, take some water. You'll feel better. Inigo, how many days will it take to reach Rome? <laughs> Rome? The word Rome frightened Master Ignatius more than ever.
As the days went by, Lainas got weaker and weaker. He could not walk any further. So we had to carry him until we found some help. They found a resting place after two days of troubled journey. Master Ignatius was troubled furthermore. Peter took courage to do something that we never dare to do. Father Ignatius, what scares you? From scares me! Peter, let's go back to Venice. There is no turning back, Father. There is no turning back. We have traveled so long. Peter, 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 you don't understand me. We will be persecuted there. If we need to die, let us die together. You yourself told me that God is with us. And who will be against us? Let us face our fears, Father. Let us face. Father Ignatius, I believe in you. Take time and take your decisions. Thereafter, they never spoke a word. November 1537, located close to La Strota Chapel, near Rome, there was a dark cave. He saw something.
Ignatius, I want you to serve us. emerged from the cave with I a fire ablazed and that fire continues I to burn to till today. Peter! Linus! There he is! Why is it? Peter! Linus! I found the Lord! I found the Lord! Peter! I will be propitious to you in Rome. Turned all his sorrows into joy. Finally, they found consolation in each other's presence. Eternal City leaped with joy with their arrival. Many martyrs have shed their blood. This place is really holy. I must pay my respect. To this holy and eternal city, he gave his heart and soul. Long live Roma.
I will be propitious to you in Rome. 